Ladies and gentlemen, referee Chris Dione is going to stop to this contest at three minutes, 38 seconds of round number two. Declaring the winner by submission due to a rear naked choke and still undefeated Bone Nick Hall. I'm here with the winner, Bo Nickel. Bo, at the end of that fight, you booed yourself and gave yourself two thumbs down. Why did you do that? You know, um, I feel like I'm a little bit embarrassed with that performance just because I expect to go out there and completely dominate and shut this guy out. And I gave him a little bit uh, too many opportunities. But at the same time, I feel really grateful because I did get to get past the first round, which in my mind is now that I'm a few seconds removed, kind of ideal because I was able to, you know, have that experience under my belt now. Well, Cody was probably the most difficult and certainly the most experienced ex opponent in the UFC that you've faced so far. What, what was different about this fight? I think he was just more confident. Like, he uh, came out to fight, which is great. And uh, for me, you know, it's a good learning experience now. I know the guy's confident. Um, I'll just, um, I guess, um, be a little more uh, tactical and, you know, not get into positions that I'm uh, vulnerable. Well, there's so much pressure that people put on you and so much pressure that you also put on yourself. You have so few fights, but yet you're one of the most watched guys in the sport. What is that like? It's awesome. You know, I'm just grateful for all the people that support me. And I think all the people that want to see me lose, I'm going to turn you guys around. I love you guys. You know, I appreciate y'all. And uh, the more I win these fights, I'm going to keep climbing up. I'm going to keep dominating. And all of you are going to love me. I guarantee it. Now. For your next opponent, what type of fighter would you like to face? How far up the ladder you want to move? You know, um, I don't really care. I'm 28, and uh, I got a long, long career ahead of me. Um, I want to fight a better guy. That's the thing for me. Every single fight, I'm going to fight better and better guys. I think people forget. I'm like 5-0, and so it's now 6-0. and um, And most of the guys I'm fighting have 15, 20 fights. So, you know, I think by the time I'm 10, 12-0, and I'll be fighting for the belt. So just keep that in your mind. Next time I fight a guy, if he's not, you know, the number one guy or something, just, I got six fights, so relax. Do you have any names on your mind? Um, you know, I think uh, Anthony Hernandez is a guy I could fight. I like Kapilov. They just had a good fight. You know, take anybody in the division, I'm coming for you guys. So if you're lucky enough to get the call to fight me, just be grateful and sign that contract. Congratulations, sir. Bo Nickel, ladies and gentlemen.